Oh, shut up. What have you been doing? Hi gems and welcome back to my channel. So today, as you guys can see by the title, I am back, baby, with Bird the Tin, season three. If you have not seen my reaction to episode one, please make sure to go check it out right up here. It was so fun. I missed the show so much. I hope y'all liked my reaction. I'm filming it right after the other one, so I am not sure, but you know, we're here. But yeah, dude, I'm like so excited to get right into episode two, just because like this season is so good. And can I just say, cause I was thinking about it. Y'all really have been waiting weeks for part two what is up with netflix why can we just binge a show like we used to back in the day mm? what are you talking about part one and part two yeah no no give it to me now but hopefully by the time i finish episode four the next part comes out because i am not waiting i don't know about y'all but i cannot wait i can't do it but anyways hi how y'all doing hope y'all doing good today if you guys want to check out my full uncut reactions to this episode and episode one from last time please make sure to go check out my patreon it is only five dollars a month if you are interested it'll be linked down in the description but yeah i'm excited as hell to get into episode two so let's get into it all right let's go No matter how many jewels anxious mamas might see. Wow. So everyone's sending her stuff to be like, please pick a diamond. That she thinks I am afraid of choosing a diamond. I think you are, Why babes. Should I, be? I think you I are. Might With your success. And give Whistledown exactly what she wants, I will not. Yeah, okay. Besides, sure, queen, I'll, I'll give you. Nearly enough sure. From it is she who should be afraid. Okay. Gentle you make her afraid, Rita, Charlotte. Doomed to spinsterhood until she married Baron Ely. Yeah, so just wait. I don't understand why they think like ripe age of six and twenty still manage six and twenty. Six and twenty. Am I stupid? Well, yes. Okay. Anyways, anywho, just because you don't get a husband the first time you come in to the scene doesn't mean that you're a sphinxer. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Six and tw twenty six, bitch. Oh my god, I'm dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, I was really out here thinking six and twenty. I'm dumb. Anyways, Oi. look at y'all. This is your house now. Apparently, this is for all of you, little boy. Which is wild. Like, look at him. Like, he's like touching stuff. Yeah, this is his. Like, this is wild. How many rooms are there? Twenty-seven, including the servants' quarters. What the Mind fuck? You do not bother Separate rooms. Of course. That is how it is done. No. At other times. How it's done? He wants to be with his wife. The hell? Oh my God! Get a hobby. Get a job. Do something. What, this what is this? Step your pussy up, honey. Get a job. Own a business. Be suck a dick. Did you not promise Anthony you would give society a try? Yo, they are I fucking the hell out of Colin. Y'all, damn! They're taking off his clothes with them looks. She looks Seth. so pretty and green. Oh my God. I'm just like now realizing like she looks so gorge. Often that is all it takes. Men are quite simple beings. Yes, Colin. Oh, they I are. Like Too simple sometimes. Like it's it's sad. Such a splendid weather we are having. Tone it down three notches. <laughs> Penelope. Quite well, my lord. <laughs> She's too cute. Mm. Oh, it's okay, babe. You're trying. You'll get it. Flirting doesn't come easy for everyone. And also, she doesn't want any of these men. Like, she wants Colin. So, of course, she's, like, gonna feel, like, weird about it. Putting the uh, cart somewhat before the horse. Yeah, like, get to mating first, ladies. But Albion and I are very passionate. Of course. It's good. And you? She don't <coughs> like mm, her man. I feel bad, though, because, like, she genuinely is in a relationship that she doesn't want to be. With. Do you think babies simply appear in your She womb? really trying to get her you fucking daughter's laid like damn If you want to beat your sister you must try harder This is funny I'm sorry but this is hilarious Who the fuck is this <sighs> Colin Ew don't don't be like Anthony, please I'm decidedly This shit pissed me off so much because like back in the day like men yeah, they could fuck around, they could have multiple women, they could have sex with whoever and be perfectly fine. But God forbid a man looks at a woman a certain way. Those are titties. Oh my God. <laughs> Same time tomorrow. Same time? Excuse me, bitch. Oh, sir, please get a grip. Get a grip. But yeah, God forbid a girl like looks at a man too hard. Oh, she's a whore. Like, oh my God. You agree I am unteachable. Whoa. Jump into conclusions, ma'am. About it. 
teasing me. Con, open your eyes, man. This girl likes lie. you. Look at the way she looks at you. Mmm. Pen, living for the estimation of others is a trap. Once you break free, the world opens Yeah, like, up. be who you are. Sorry. <laughs> but seriously, though, like, be you. At the end of the day, if people don't like you for you, then fuck them. So that I may have my freedom. So that I may feel comfortable in the world. That's crazy. That That's the only way you'll feel comfortable in the world. world is by having a man. Are they actually sleeping in different beds for real? Because the way I would have skedaddled my way to my husband's room because you're making me not sleep next to my man? Yeah, no thanks. You're bugging. That's crazy. And then they can't do anything about it? Like, that's wild. Over 30 new gowns, all in desperate need of alteration. It's like a brand. It's like her life flipped a switch. It's crazy. You tempered when it is hungry. She's so pretty. Oh my god. The prospect of marriage is the one aspect of the season that I welcome. So she does want to get married. She just needs to find the perfect guy. I have some information you might like to know. Always scheming something up, Eloise. Do you think me a magician? Mm. I love are. when girls it's beat boys in games. It's so funny. No, thank you. I'm happy to wait here. Oh, it's Penelope. Penelope. We're going to the British enjoying room. She's like, <laughs> why? Whoa. Gonna... And the rest of your family. She's freaking out. <laughs> be leaving that table in the immediate future. But now y'all are gonna be alone. And she's nervous. <laughs> and we can pretend we are at a ball. Yo, she's gonna fall more in love with this man. Got... I'm telling you now. Of the decoration. Across the room. This is so cute gentlemen though. So nice of him to do that for her. With the dashing suitor you just met by the refreshment. Okay, we're role playing, bitch. She's gonna fall in love. I hope he falls in love too. He sees the risk that she got. That's what I'm hoping. Somehow my character gets lost between my heart and my mouth. It's okay. Speaking I find myself hard. saying that. Imagine what you would want to say to me if I were a suitor. She has a lot of things she wants to say to you, Colin, okay? Don't get her started. Your eyes. Let me let me lock That's in. Remarkable. And see. I, I might say something like that. <laughs> she she meant that. Mm. Look, even he felt it. Yo. Eloise is here. You can hide in the study. Hide? We're hiding them? She left her little shawl thing though. They're gonna know she's like someone's here. Oh my goodness. Secret love. I can now declare with great certainty the Paris of some of the most beautiful women. Oh, she's being nosy. Girl, stop. But he's still alone at night. Yeah, don't don't read that. Stop it. <laughs> Feel such intimacy, but also such great put it distance. Put it down. Were you reading that? No, no, no I, I, I did not mean to. reading did that. Mean to my... Whatever she read in there was some nasty shit that you were doing in Paris. That's what it was, and you didn't want her to know. Not the hands. It's always the hands. <laughs> in Bridgerton, it's always the hands. Indeed. Thank you for the um lesson yeah let's hope to do it again soon y'all i'm so excited for their love story because i read somewhere that they apparently during their intimate scenes they broke furniture yeah crazy oh my gosh she's gonna run into someone i can already tell Oop. Hi. It's even worse though because Eloise knows that Lady Whistledown wrote about Colin was her and she's like, Ugh, girl, what? That, I want right to see now. what you just said written on paper. In fact, she seeks to take a husband this season. <laughs> a husband? Penelope. Yeah, girl. Mm -hmm. Get into it. She's not seeking a husband in you, I hope. No, I'm only helping her. I mean, she low key is, but she ain't gonna say that. <laughs> and that is why we're not telling anyone. More secrets. Love it. Wow, the queen's hair, it eats every time. Like, the wigs are just... Like, I love her. She's a bad bitch. I'm sorry. So that your circle is wider than simply Miss Cooper. Yeah, make some new friends, girl. I plan to. <laughs> I do enjoy a good turn. <laughs> There you go. Friends. <laughs> At tea, Lady Danbury mentioned a musically inclined suitor. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. she wants to meet them. Yay. Dude, if I close my eyes, I see Daphne. She speaks just like her. Go ahead, girl. Do your quick. thing, Penelope. Mr. You Finch. got it, girl. Perhaps if you savored her as much as you do food, she would be with Chuck by now. Damn. <laughs> this woman is not bomb messing bomb. around. Delicate. Has anyone told you that your mother is rather terrified? Oh yeah, she's scary as fuck. Don't play with her. Much better. Thanks to you. 
I'm sorry. You're welcome. But you shouldn't have been picking up glass with your hands, boy. Should we make an agreement? I will consider it if you speak to at least one lord tonight. Very well. Let's go, Pen. Let's do it. And you, a Penelope Featherington. Do not forget that. Ah, yo. Yes, Colin. Their friendship is so cute. I can't. Someone died. Okay. What happened? He's not in the right his state of mind. Recently died. Oh, his horse. We shall gallop along. <laughs> Yo, Colin. Chill out, my guy. You make her giggle. <laughs> it seems Colin is helping her look for a husband. Why are you telling her this? We no. Like, why would you tell her that? That's just gonna use that against her. Do you have any special talents with which you hope to impress the queen? Talent? No. She don't want to impress no one. Very. Unfortunately, I'll is that BTS? Sorry, that's fucking BTS in my ear right now. Out of all the songs you could have, you would have picked. Was this one really Bridgerton? Dynamite is crazy. <laughs> they could have picked like Black Swan. Yeah, <laughs> that Bridgerton. really took me you off guard. Excellent. Now I see why no one came to the bar for so long. Oh yeah, because they've never actually been to balls or anything like that. Because they were not, you know, ladies or lords. So look at them now. Oh, wow. She wants you. Hmm. <laughs> and all these society rules when even someone born into this world cannot grasp. It's going to be hard, but y'all got it. Y'all are smart and intelligent. You got it. All these rules are to keep the marriage mark churning. Yeah, but you're married. You so who gives a fuck? Performed, you are free. Yeah, literally. All they care about is marrying people off. So once you're married, they don't care. The best thing you can do is to let her be in her natural sphere. Then. Yeah, let her find her match. She'll find it. She'll know when she finds it. What about you? No, she doesn't like too? her husband. Like, at all. Oh, I do not enjoy it. That sucks, dude. I actually feel bad for her, because that sucks. Inserts himself. What? Inserts himself where? What have you been doing? And then he goes to change his britches. His oh, my britches remain on? Of course. What? <sighs> Shut up. Shut up. So you're not actually having sex. And this is why sex education is important, even in the 1800s. Because you remember when Daphne was like, um, how do you become a child after having sex already and she didn't even know? Like, come on, please educate the women, please. Honey, now I can stuff my mouth with chocolates without fear of appearing impolite. Excuse me, ladies. <laughs> Eloise is so had funny. Enough time. Shut the fuck up. I cannot think of anything at the moment. Yes. Okay, all right, all right. Redeeming yourself, I see you. I was about to say, you better not spill. Featherington, it is a fine evening. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh my God, he's in a wheelchair? That's what they used to look like back in the day? Come on, that's cool, I've never seen that before. I love the diversity in the show. Like, we just saw someone in a wheelchair earlier, somebody who was deaf, that's awesome. And that is why Lady Carter fell off tonight's guest list. <laughs> okay, so they're gonna ha like to gossip. Also, I see that look, Colin. Hmm. Jealousy, jealousy. Lord Remington has asked to call on me tomorrow. Oh, I no, like that they, you know. Do you? She's muscles. They stick together. <laughs> I see that look. Colin, don't play with me, Colin. You like her, Loki. Perhaps overly so. Oh, shut the hell up. Uh-uh. Oh, fuck. Especially someone who is so beyond hope of success. Oh, shut your ass up. Who yapped? You have to be kidding me. Leave this poor girl alone. Do they have nothing better to do? Yeah, they didn't. They really didn't. <laughs> See, Eloise, this is why you shouldn't have said anything. These bitches don't keep their mouth shut. What could Penelope possibly have done to warrant such maltreatment? Well, if only you knew. They should have came up with, like, a lie to tell people because, oh my god. And she's so good at it too. Oh, uh, I see what I see what she's doing. Uh-huh. Okay, okay. She she put her there, told her, oh, I'm gonna go show you a painting. And is gonna see how well she plays the piano. Sparkling, one might say. Yes, you did it! Lady Danbury is that girl. Like she really is. <laughs> she does it for the girls every time. <gasps> My lady. Hello. Not in a cold, lonely room by myself. You yeah. heard Mrs. Carner. That is not how it is Who done. Who gives a shit? Make yes, the rules. We, we are a married, noble <laughs> He took what Benedict told him and he was like, aye, we could do whatever now. The same as every Viscount and Earl and Baron. No, and literally. Earl. Absolutely. Literally. Nothing. So vast in the richness that you got now, okay? Enjoy it. <laughs> 
Oh, she's crying. Poor baby. Don't let them get to you. Oh my god. Good evening, Lady Danbury. A letter for you, Mom. It's so rare seeing her with her hair down. It's so cute. To enlist the help of Mr. Colin Bridgerton. Damn, she even has to write about herself in there. And it's while crazy. we knew... Is this what you wanted to happen? I do not know of what you're speaking. She actually you didn't say anything. About in communicating the secret I told you in confidence. I think the other girl really not help heard her. Because she didn't say anything. I do appreciate your concern about cruelty. But perhaps you should like to find a looking glass. Mm. She said, look at yourself in the mirror, sister, because you ain't no worse than me. That's what she said. Damn, that's crazy. But that's true, though. She does like to gossip as well. Like, she's no different than them. Not that you earnestly believed you might find a husband in your third year. Oh, my out. God. Yes, yeah, she can. Damn, give her some props or something, mom. She can find herself a man and wait till she does. Y'all gonna be... It's quiet, ain't, ain't no, no back bed. talk. Trust me, men can often cause much more trouble than they're worth. That is true. But if she wants to get married, let her. Let her have the choice. To return to her familiar shadows once and for all. No. You better go out there, girl. And you better find yourself a husband. What are you doing here? <gasps> it's Colin! He cares, y'all. He cares! A sad, stupid girl who believes she might possibly have a chance of love. No, you must not say stop. such things. Literally. You're so sweet. You need someone. Could I ask you something? Ooh. What? Hold on. What? Would I'm sad. Would you kiss me? Oh! Huh? <gasps> Sorry. What? Kissed and I am not certain I ever will be. Wow, I she's lost die. all hope. Please. Oh my gosh, she's pleasing? Please. Please. Oh my god. It's not like he hasn't kissed other women, so it's, it's not like it matters to him. He just feels bad probably. Like, damn girl, like, you really, like, don't think anyone else is going to like you like that? But this is gonna be a thing, so it's fine. Nobody ruined this, okay? Ah! <gasps> they did it! Ooh! That's it! Hey now! Hey now! You know it's good when they go back for more. Wait, why am I excited for her? Because I just know this is what's going to kick it off. I hope. But it is really sad that she really thinks. Oh, stop. Not a thank you. Wow. But it's really sad that she thinks like she's a lost cause. Like there's nothing else that they people could do for her. But he liked it. I'm telling you. All right. Oh my God. I love the show, y'all. I really do. Well, that was episode two. I hope you guys enjoyed because I am in love with this show and like their story is like enemies to lovers what Kate and Anthony were I eat that shit up every time like I love it so much but like friends to lovers is also so cute so I'm excited to see where it takes us so if you want more make sure to subscribe and put the notifications on to know whenever I have a new video coming out. As you guys know, I'm watching each one individually and I'll be posting them twice a week. So make sure to stay tuned for that. Also, if you liked my reaction, please make sure to like the video and check out my socials in the description as well. But okay, y'all, I'm gonna go. I love you guys so, so, so much. Please make sure to take care of yourselves and I will see you guys next time. Bye.